So hello guys welcome back to the channel I hope you all are absolutely fine and sound and here is a quick update regarding the arcade facilitator program so as you all are aware that the arcade facilitator program started from 4th of August 2025 and the initial deadline was 6th of October but based on the request of many participants we have extended it till 13th of October now today is the last date and you have time till 13th of October basically today till 11 59 pm so in case you haven't completed any arcade game make sure to complete it to reach your milestone many of you are having multiple queries over here so i'll cover this on this video also so first of all if you're new to this channel do like the video and just subscribe the channel so the first query is that many of you are asking that i have completed some of the lab free courses here you can see total 24 lab free courses are mentioned over here but some of you have completed at least one or three courses before 4th of August. So will those, basically will those LAFRI courses counted if you complete any other from the catalog? So the answer is no. If you have by any chance, by any chance if you have completed any of the LAFRI courses before 4th of August, even on 3rd of August, then also the LAFRI courses won't be counted and you won't be eligible for the top milestone if you are targeting it. Regarding skill badges, there is no limitation. You can complete any skill badges from the master sheet also or from their official catalogs over here. Like here, there is no restriction that you have to complete only these skill badges. For lab free courses, there is a restriction that you have to complete only these lab free courses. But for skill badges, there is no restriction, so you can complete it. Now, many of you are having multiple queries regarding the arcade games. So, which games are being counted for the facilitator milestone? And as today is the last step, so you need to hurry up and complete all these games. Now, many of you are asking, will these Diwali games will be counted in the arcade facilitator milestone bonus? So, the answer is no. If you complete this arcade, basically three pointer game, then you'll get three, three, six points for both these games. But these games won't be counted at the arcade facilitator milestone games, which is mentioned as arcade games. For this, you have to complete this base camp, level three, level one, level two. All these four games you have base camp, level one, level two, level three to complete the arcade games and for trivias we have only that four trivias you can complete depending on the milestone in which you are residing okay so this was the quick update i wanted to share regarding the solution here is the master sheet you can see here now if we are lacking with some skill badges now we have 71 ps skill badges so you have to come over here and simply click on it. Now let me brief you about the pre-assessment skill badges. Now here just by completing one lap you are getting one skill badge. So suppose you are lacking basically 20 skill badges. Then you can complete it easily with just 20 laps. And basically you need to understand the concept that try to complete the skill badges which does not require a credit. What does it mean? Here, let me show you, for example, this is a skill badge. Okay, there are multiple skill badges which require credits and which do not require credits. So here you can see this is the skill badge. We have to complete only the, basically the challenge lab. And here you can see it's mentioning no cost. So basically, if you complete this, it will come under 15 lab limits. But here is a quick trick. Suppose if you want to complete, you have to just locate it yourself. Do not worry about it. It's very easy. You have to come over here. And here you can see five credits. So suppose if you complete skill badges, which mentions over here that we require credits, then you'll be able to complete it. And we have already got 600 free credits in the arcade facilitator program. So it will be becoming very easy for you to complete the challenge. So this was the quick update I wanted to share. Very few hours are limited and you have to complete it. Now there won't be any extension. So hurry up and complete it. Now what will happen after the arcade facilitator program ends? A dedicated video will be there. Do not worry about it. Can you still claim the swags and what are the updates? So in short, if you want to ask that the swags claim form will be out in january and you'll be getting then only apart from this all detailed information will be available on the channel do like the video and subscribe the channel thank you have a great day ahead